So I just bought this 12 pack case of MREs. Now there's a few really important things you need to consider when buying MREs, starting with how do you know if they're authentic? I've also got an individual MRE broken out here. We'll go through an example of what one looks like and we'll break open the box and look at the variety included. So there's a few things to look for when determining authenticity. First of all, government issued MREs are gonna have a date pack number. So this is 1078, which I'll tell you how to decode that. And then it has an inspection date right here. So I'll go over that in a second. You'll also see it says US government property right here. There's only a few different companies that are authorized to produce real MREs. But in general, this is what they look like in the case. So keep in mind, this is 12 individual meals right here. Box is actually a lot smaller than I was expecting when I bought it, I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger. So really compact for 12 full meals. All right, so what's the deal with the inspection date and how does that differ from an expiration date? So MREs are gonna have two date stamps on it, the date it was packaged, and you'll see a four digit code here. The first number is gonna represent the year in the current decade. So this particular case was manufactured in 2021, and then this three digit number represents the number of days in that year. So if it was 001, that would be January 1st. If it was 028, that would be January 28th. In this case, 78 puts us at March 19th for this particular case. Then you'll have the inspection date. So you'll notice that MREs don't have expiration dates. They have inspection dates. So inspection dates are typically three years after the manufacturing date. So that's really the most important thing you need to look for when buying MREs on Amazon. You need to make sure the inspection date is what you expect. You don't wanna buy uh, MREs that have a five-year-old uh, inspection date, yes, you'll save some money and a lot of times they'll still be good, but you just wanna keep that in mind and know what you're buying. So how do you know if an MRE is still good? So that's why they don't provide an expiration date because the shelf life of MREs really depends upon the storage conditions, mostly the temperature. Luckily, MREs usually have this fresh check uh, indicator right here and if the center of this circle is dark, gray like the outside, that means um, it has experienced temperatures that are out of spec with uh, what would be considered safe consumption. So this can be a quick indicator to know that your MREs are still safe to eat, but generally the cooler temperature you store these in, the longer they'll last. From the research I've done, you can typically expect that they'll be good up to five years from the manufacturing date, but really if they're stored in a nice cool environment, um, you could go much longer than that. So here's what an individual meal looks like. It's gonna be self-contained in a fully sealed uh, disposable bag. And when you open it up, you're gonna notice there's a lot of parts and pieces. So that's one thing that's really cool about MREs. You get a lot of variety with every single meal. It's not like a freeze-dried meal where you just have a bag of like dehydrated or freeze-dried food where that's all you're gonna eat. So for example, with this meal, you've got crackers, syrup, peanut butter, a maple muffin top, dry roasted peanuts, pork sausage patty, and you get an electrolyte uh, beverage powder. This is grape flavored. And in here you get matches, some gum, some instant coffee, and a napkin in moist towelette. Every kit includes a spoon as well, and the matches aren't for starting a fire to cook the meal. You don't need any type of stove or uh, cooking uh, equipment at all. It actually has a heater that's included to heat up the meal. There's, there's instructions right on here, but you essentially just add water and it reacts with the chemical inside here and creates a heater to heat up the meal. So literally all you need is water to prepare the meal. And that's one of the biggest benefits of an MRE is the lack of uh, requirements for preparing the meal. Now, the drawbacks of an MRE, I would say the biggest thing is just the amount of waste that gets produced at the end of the meal. So if you're backpacking and need to hike out all of your waste with you, MREs are definitely gonna produce a lot of waste. But again, the biggest advantage being you can just grab a single bag and have a full meal, all you need is water, and you're good to go. So let's open up this actual case here so we can see how it's packed. So this is going to be a variety of different meals. Um, each one is gonna be different. So the menus are kind of numbered. So this is the chicken burrito bowl. Here's menu 20, Italian sausage with peppers and onions and marinara sauce. Number 22, beef goulash. 23, pizza slice, pepperoni. So you get a big variety of different meals uh, in a case. 
So again, if you're looking for authentic MREs, you don't want to look for like mil spec or anything that has like different graphics. This is what they look like. You want to look for that inspection date on the side. Make sure it's what you're expecting uh, to pay for. Obviously, newer uh, cases are going to cost more money than ones that are closer or past their inspection date. But that's my overview of these authentic MREs.